yes, yeah, so someone took me out of SPK and I, the video by itself raw just looks bad. So I decided I need to make a video explaining it so everybody can understand. So first of all, the video that you're going to see here in a second, right? There is a wreck on top of this bridge out there in Dallas. I turned around and saw that there was no pack behind us and everybody stopped on the bridge. So I'm like, huh, I'm going to go see what's going on. If it was bad enough that everybody stopped, you know, uh, you know, maybe, you know, I don't know. Maybe something's really hurt. Maybe someone I know. I'm going to turn around and go look real quick, right? Because I know everybody, right? I know all the stunt riders, you know, I care about them. So I turn around, go down the sidewalk a ways, jump up, go around one car, and then I hit it and I'm going up the ramp by myself, right? To my knowledge, I was by myself. But what I didn't know was what there was a Squid Missile 2000 fresh on my tail. <laughs> And I didn't know. I had no idea that there was some freaking squid following me up the wrong way on a one-way street. So I'm going up the street, and now I see Hansel, you know, the dude on that FYI, that guy. And I see him waving the turn around, and I see they're all coming. I'm like, oh, crap. So I lock up my brake. Do this, and kabam! Anyway, so watch the video. So that happened. I talk, I finally got a hold of the guy. I talked to the guy. The guy says it's my fault. <laughs> He wants me <laughs> to pay for his stuff. He goes, you, you turned in front of me. Well, yeah, if I was going the correct way down a one-way road and I U-turned for no reason, that would make sense. But the fact that I'm going up the wrong way on a one-way, there's a pack of motorcycles obviously moving towards us now. I'm getting on my brakes. What do you think I'm going to do? Pull over and take a piss and you can just ride around me and charge into the bikes head on? Like what? The, 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 the reason I say this is because I'm trying to show his argument. It doesn't make any sense. He's just a squid is what it comes down to. The guy's a freaking squid. Didn't see the bikes coming. Didn't know what I was doing. Just his brain is just not working because he's a squid. That's what squids do. They don't process stuff. I already saw what was coming. The bikes are all coming. I need to turn around. I'm on a one way going the wrong way up a one way. I did not expect somebody to be there. Ah! So yeah, he took took me out. Took my whole bike out. The wrap was just done. I made one video riding it around. I didn't even have time to do my version of a wrap reveal video. Isn't that freaking sad? It's just sad. It's just straight sad. And the worst part of it is that the guy, instead, I mean, I don't even care if the guy would pay for the damages he did. I don't give a crap about all that. If I just messaged him and he admitted to the fact that that was wrong of him to plow into me, going the wrong way down a one-way street, like, cool. You don't have no money? Cool. The guy was all like, I still owe 9000 on my 2020, blah, 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 blah. I don't give a crap how much you owe, dude. I don't, just, uh. Anyway, I don't know. I'm a little squid frustrated around. I got a little squid syndrome going on right now. I got to work through it. But, yeah. So, yeah, the video without context looks bad. Looks like I'm just going down the street and I turned around right in front of him randomly. But 
the bike like in the video I show you you should be able to see how close all the other bikes were to us at that time so like mm -hmm. if I wouldn't have done that and he would have hit me he probably would have went head on into some of the stunt guys that were probably wheeling at that point so I probably saved somebody's life who knows uh, but the, 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 the part that just grinds my gears is the fact that he thinks it's my fault. He really had the audacity to say that I needed to pay for his stuff. And he, uh, he, said, he said, well, if I buy the stuff, will you at least help me fix it? <laughs> yeah, all right, dude. I'm going go, to go labor away on your motorcycle after you nearly killed me. Like, he hit me just at the right spot. I'm pretty sure this finger's broke because I can't really squeeze, you know, this one. But, you know, whatever, dude. Like, I'm, I'm still good. My bike's screwed up. I'll fix it, no big deal, normal freaking stuff, like it happens all the time. Not all the time, but you know what I mean, like uh, this is stunt riding. You gotta, you gotta watch out for the squids. And unfortunately, I, of all people, did not think, surely no freaking squid will follow me down a one-way street towards a bunch of bikes. <sighs> but anyway, he did. I got hurt a little bit. My back hurts, my neck hurts, my helmet screwed up, like my bike screwed up. It's really, 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 really annoying. Just really annoying. I'm super frustrated, but I don't know. I'm frustrated, but I'm over it. Like, it's whatever. I'm gonna fix my bike. I'm gonna take all the fairings off. I'm gonna get fairings for it. It'll be fine. So yeah, bros, moral story is stay away from the squids. They're gonna run you over, always. Even if you think that no one could possibly be going also, the, his speed. Why was he going so much faster? Like, everything about it. I, I, I can go on for hours. Everything about it. He literally comes flying up behind like I'm on my brakes. Why are you not on your brakes, you freaking squid? Why did you not sit there and say, huh, this guy's getting on his brakes. Huh, this guy's tires locked up. Huh, there's a bunch of motorcycles heading towards us right now. I know what I'm going to do. I'm going to keep ex keep never not touching my brake and just roll past this guy over here towards all these motorcycles coming straight at me and everything will be fine. Ah! Like that doesn't make any sense. Anyway, Brad, I just wanted to make a video real quick explaining it because, you know, I don't know. It, I, I can't just post it and then not have an explanation video. I got to be able to be like, look, if you just look at the video, it looks bad. If you understand the context of the fact that some squid missile was following me up a one-way street going the wrong direction when a bunch of bikes were coming down, I slowed down to turn around and get out of their way because they're going the right way, I'm going the wrong way, and squid missile just decides to plow straight through me. Annoying. Anyway, I also would just like to add, look at how this guy reacts. He gets, he gets off his bike, throws his gloves on the ground, like a little hissy fit, and what am I already doing? I'm already over there after he just pancaked me straight on the ground. I'm already picking my bike up, messing with my key, getting it set up. He's still over there trying to undo his helmet and cry to himself about how hurt his motorcycle is. He's got other guys picking up his bike while he's sitting over there taking off his helmet, crying about his motorcycle, like, like, I'm over here like trying to get out of the way and get on with life like I'm already over it. I'm ready to go. I just, I don't know. He, he's just a bitch. I don't like him. Oh, and uh, thanks Brian for letting me borrow your bike for a minute to do this video because all mine are broke. Thank you. Love you. Okay.